Hey guys and welcome back and as you can see I have some stuff to unpack for y'all so let's get into it. Um, I think the first one yes is these two boxes are from Sephora. Um, I think they had a 20% off sale or something um, and I was holding these this was a minute ago because I was holding these to wait for the other stuff that I'm going to show y'all so um, I was waiting for a Sheen and Timu order but it's been delayed so I will make that a separate video. So, in the first box from Sephora, I almost don't even remember what I got, honestly. So, let's see what I got. So, I have this Sephora Tested, not Sephora, it is Sephora, E-N-Z-K-O-M Tested Dark Spot Serum. Um had a couple of bumps a couple of dark spots came back so i wanted to test out something else it said 93 percent of its ingredients are from a natural origin um and i if you've used this before please let me know um it has the kombucha in it and the enzymes from the origin extract uh known as papaya which we know they say um does dark spots it says you can use every day am and pm on a dry face this time instead of putting this in my bathroom because a lot of times I will wash my face and everything and walk right out of the bathroom. So I think I'm going to put this like on my nightstand or where I go to plug my phone up at night. So before I go to bed, I remember to use it. I don't normally use them in the daytime unless um, I'm not wearing makeup because you never know how the serums are going to play under makeup. I had one serum and it just when I put my makeup on it rolled. Like it actually rolled up into like jelly rolls or something. I don't really know how to explain it. So I'm really careful about that. I may try it one day with makeup um, just to see how it does. And that's all they put in this box, y'all. I don't know why they didn't put my order all together. Maybe they had to wait for the serum to come in. I don't know why they sent me two boxes. And that one thing was in that one box. To me, if Sephora get better on shipping, they won't have to charge so much. Um, I wanted to try the commodity um, everybody kept talking about the commodity, which one, did, the milk commodity perfume, um, but I saw this, and this is like a sample of all of them, so I'm going to go ahead and give it a try, but everybody kept ranting and raving, I think, about the commodity gold milk, um, so I'm going to test them all out and see what I think about it. If y'all want to know what I think, comment below, but that... Um, I got for the sale and then I got my milk what did I get is this the primer or the makeup this is the mattifying primer got the milk mattifying primer I love this primer it is mattifying and plays very well with a lot of foundations I normally use the um the milk of magnesia and I'm still using that or the calamine lotion but sometimes like if I'm not going nowhere for a long time or if I'm just going to an event and I'm not going to be there for a long time I will just use a primer um, also, sometimes I will prime my face and then do the calamine lotion and then do my face. Now, that's if I know I'm going to be going somewhere for six, seven, eight, nine, ten hours and I don't want my makeup to come off. Okay. I think this was a free sample. The Huda, the Huda Blendable Water Sweat Transfer Proof Foundation. Nope, concealer concealer so we're gonna test this baby out um huda i don't really buy their foundations because they have a smell like a perfume smell and i don't like the smell that smell all day so i tried a huda beauty foundation a long time ago but i didn't really care for it because of the smell like i could smell it even on their powders and i'm not one of those people that likes the um i don't like stuff with a fragrance in it um so we'll see if their new foundation um has a fragrance they're claiming luminous matte now i've never seen nobody do luminous matte before if y'all know a foundation as luminous matte let me know because normally it's luminous or it's matte okay they're doing <coughs> a luminous matte concealer excuse me <coughs> what i like about it is it said it is waterproof sweat proof and transfer proof so i may have to go into sephora and see if that comes in the foundation and see if it has that perfume smell um, and then my perfume sample that I chose was the Giorgio Armani My Way. That's just in the free sample with your order. What I chose, okay? So that is that. 
I love, I'm going to have to read the reviews on this because waterproof, sweatproof, transfer proof, if their foundation is that and, it's, and it doesn't have that perfume smell, I'm going to try it. Do y'all know any waterproof, sweatproof, transfer proof foundation? Because most of them are transfer proof or waterproof, which I don't even know if that's true. Um, Walmart. I finally got these from Walmart. I had been seeing them for a while. And I'm not going to lie to y'all. The reason why it took me so long, everybody kept lying and saying these things was $11 and stuff. These things are $20 a piece. Okay. But I had a little bit of extra money and I went ahead and splurged on both. But they've been in my Walmart cart for a while. So I'm not going to lie like everybody else and tell y'all these things are $11 because they're not. Also, Amazon sells them. Um, Amazon sells them for the same price. Um, both of them offer free shipping. So, I finally got my hands on the Daisy Rose traveling makeup traveling case with the clear window. Um, it's supposed to be, you know, you know what it's imitating. Um, and I'll show y'all. I got the white colored one and the brown colored one. And I just think they're so cute when I see people do a what's in my bag and pull these out. But people kept saying that they were like $11, $11. And I've had these things in my cart since last year, waiting for them to go down to $11. They're not. Also, daisyrolls.com. They are the same price with free shipping. So this is the um, white one. And this is the brown one. And I couldn't make up my mind. I guess I could, could have bought one and bought another one later. But like I said, it, it just was about everybody that did a what's in my bag. Their price wasn't right. And I'm like, maybe it goes on sale. Maybe it's going to go down Christmas time. Christmas time, I was waiting for it to go down. I'm like, it's Christmas time. And then after Christmas, I was waiting for it to go down. And I'm like, these things are not $11. Maybe they was at some point. Maybe the ones people are showing in their videos they bought two or three years ago. Maybe people buying them shot the price up, but they are $20, you guys, $19.98 to be exact. So if you are interested, you can find them, like I said, on Amazon, on Walmart, or on the official site, which is daisyrose.com. So this is everything that I ordered, and then I'm going to show you guys. Um, actually, I'll do that for another video. I picked up some stuff for my um, to get ready to decorate my Valentine's Day table. And I'm going to show you guys the stuff that I picked up um, to do the table. And then I'm going to show y'all the table. So um, I will wait on that one. But that is it for this order. If you guys have tried any of this stuff, have any suggestions, or your friends have tried it and you know it's good or whatever, let me know. Let me know. Let me know. And let me know if you have already tried the new Huda Beauty Foundation. Um, I don't know if this comes in a foundation. Don't quote me on that. I have I received the concealer, but if it comes in a foundation, if it doesn't smell like perfume, blendable, buildable, brightens, corrects, waterproof, heat proof, sweat proof, transfer proof, y'all holla at your girl. Holla at your girl.